All right, so I know a lot of you guys happen to enjoy our uh, fantasy football league meeting, so I'm just gonna keep taping everything that we do with our league. At the meeting, we decided that we were gonna do uh, like a beer pong kind of tournament thing to select, uh, select our draft order, but it, it's too it was too hard to kind of get everyone together for an entire day and commit to you know having to get w wasted and do this kind of whole thing. So it's midway through August. I'm leaving for California tomorrow morning, so I'll be gone for a week, and we just don't really have time to do the draft order. Everyone's kind of getting anxious. They want to know where they're picking so they can start their mock drafts. Yada, 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 all that kind of shit. So we're going to do something that if you're an O-O-O-O-G of the channel, you've seen us do this before, probably like two or three years ago, kind of like the draft lottery. We got a container. We throw 10 pong balls in each with the initials of one league member, get a vacuum, and we suck them up. So I got to get some supplies before we head over to, I'm heading over to Nick's house and George is going to be there with us. Laptop, there he What's is. Going on? What's, What's up? <laughs> oh, he's rapping. Let's get it. Stain. What's up, Stain? So here's what we're doing for our draft order. People are getting anxious. People are yelling at the commissioner. They want to know their damn draft pick. Thus, we're settling for a draft lottery. We did this in this exact same backyard like three years ago. We got 10 pong balls. Set up a little bucket. Poke a hole right through it. Put a vacuum down there and suck a ball up. I don't know that so I could tape it together. I'll suck the balls up and you can read the names. That's true. You could do that. <laughs> Just don't put me on Facebook. So. <laughs> <laughs> Block my you face can bl out? Blur his head out. I'm not like, a, a it takes too much time to edit. You're, you're, you're going to be famous. <laughs> 10 balls. 11 balls. Why? One ringer. One went down One ringer. One was blank. Remember what's, we that's, went down here? That's he four? put 11 in the thing. What, what's the reason for 11? You gotta put the ringer Excitement, in. man! That's unbelievable. So, so, one, so we're starting with the 10th overall pick going down. Like the first pong ball out of there is 10th. Let's get that one or two, baby. I got something. We got one. <laughs> Who do we got with the 10th pick? Stevie Mag. Stevie Mag's newcomer. That's what you deserve. From row nine, baby. <laughs> Chibbles. Eric. Whoa, I thought that said Eric. <laughs> Scared me there. Next one. Number eight. Let's get it. Look at Steen. Kid looks good. Oh. Is. Is this the first time in four years you're not the number one? Not in the top. I was one to the Yeah. For seven. Roll a team. Ooh. Fellow big dogs. The eight and seven picks. Numero six. Keep on cruising, baby. Keep on cruising. My duels. Come on, duels. Six. All right, I got that top five spot. Let's go. The big dog himself. Ooh, okay. Yeah. Number five. I'm not mad at that. Or Poppy. Right, so we, got we got the number five pick <laughs> overall. I like that. There's a big five. There's one tier. Big five. I'm in it. The champ. Ooh, the defending champ gets yeah. the number four spot. <laughs> Free pick. The Hebrew Hammer. Max. We're in the top two right now. Oh, it is. My brother from another mother. Jason. The Fur Man. Interrupt this for a little bit of breaking news. Absolutely. Breaking uh, news. As reported first by TMZ, yeah, Ric Flair is out of surgery and resting with his family okay. by his side. Prayers up for Nate. Blank one's not in there. So we put a blank one in and it did not get chosen. <laughs> Lo love that. Went, went against all of Steen's principles. Uh, Final yeah, draft order. Ringer. Newcomer. No, the newcomers are, are ringing in the outsides. We'll go for, this is for who gets Julian's team. Flip it. Steve. Damn it. All right, Steve McNanny. He gets Julian's team. team. Shane gets. Shane gets Gorielle's team. Oh, so, you do that. so we have two newcomers, and since we play keepers, each one of them has to take over the previous owner's team. So we had to flip a coin for who gets whose team, because they might have keepers on their team. And uh, I, have no, I haven't looked at their, either of their teams, so I have no idea who keeps what. That wraps it up. Hope you guys enjoyed. I don't know why you would. That was a ridiculous video, but. I've got the number five pick, and I know a lot of you guys ask when our draft is. It's always Labor Day Monday. 
It's a flawless draft process because everyone's done partying for the weekend. No one has worked that Monday. It's two days before the season actually kicks off. So nothing is going to happen in between those two days. So Labor Day Monday always works if you're looking for a live draft day. For anyone who bought the draft guide, which is available to purchase on the site right there, I finish up the updated rankings, uh, taking into consideration week one's games, any of the walk-ins, Jordan Matthews moves, Zeke suspension. So the rankings were updated and I sent an email to anyone who purchased the draft guide. If for some reason you didn't get the email from me, please contact me. You can leave a comment down below. You can email me, whatever you want to do. And I will make sure that I send it to you personally. That's that. Fifth overall pick, probably about to get into a mock draft with my fifth pick. I'll put it up on the channel. I know tomorrow, or if you're watching this today, Tuesday, one, I'm leaving for Cali, two, the Titans and the Jacksonville Jaguars team outlooks drop. And I made them like a week or so ago, or maybe like a week and a half ago, so some of the stuff might be outdated. It doesn't, doesn't take into consideration Fournette's foot injury, which is supposed to be minor, so not really, it's not a big deal to me. Marquise Lee got injured. Uh, that won't be in the outlook. We'll have to do some updates there, but I also have a mock draft a best ball mock draft coming out on Thursday, and I'm gonna do a mock draft from the fifth spot. I will schedule it to upload either Saturday or Sunday for this upcoming week, and that's it. So give that video a thumbs up if you enjoyed. Subscribe to the channel if you are new, and I'll see y'all on the next episode.